Hi everyone, I just want to welcome you guys to my second webinar, which is for Jupiter. We are going to be exploring the planet of abundance, the planet that gives us our potential with regards to our growth in different ways in life that connects us to our luck the planet that gives us a joy of fulfillment with regards to our karaka as a spouse in our chart or the masculine energy that we are looking for on Jupiter webinar June 20th join me at 11 a.m. Hi Cancerians, welcome to my channel. We're doing your um, reading. How are you? Before we start, I hope you were able to watch previous episodes. Um, so I don't have to explain Sun, Moon, Rising, Ascendant, uh, Jupiter, and Venus, how to watch it. Okay, and as always, this is... Uh, watch our previous videos. Um, so you can catch up. As always, this is also Vedic Sidereal Astrology, not Western. And then... Um, if I do see the Wheel of Fortune, may it be an extended or here... Um, I do my time prediction in the extended and then I look at the planets in transit, meaning I check where the movement of planet is and how it's going to manifest in, uh, within, with you uh, and you know, with regards to romantic connection, okay? Sorry, we're ready, Cancerian. There was a Wheel of Fortune right away in the pre-shuffle and an Emperor. Uh, I was like, no. <laughs> it's like it takes too much of energy when I predict the timing. Mm -hmm. mm. Okay, so Cancerian, just to give you guys a heads up. Let's see what's going on. Cartomancy first. Uh -huh. And then we'll proceed with the tarot. Oh, so let's begin. Let's see here. Let's see. Got a two of diamonds. Okay. Busy bee. Alright. Gotta do this, gotta do that, gotta be here, gotta be that. Ooh, it sounds like Cardi B. <laughs> Ooh, Sal is a rapper, candy rapper, mm -hmm. aluminum rapper, that's what I say. Okay. So, <laughs> this is a two of, uh, two of diamonds. Now, why is he busy B? I feel like you have this bright idea to do something, but something is um, holding you back. So, it can be like you're 9 to 5, and then. You have an opportunity to do some sort of a, a side project or something like that. And then it's just like, okay, well, I got I got this uh, new project coming in. But the other, it's not a holdback, like, oh, it's a bad holdup. But it's just like, well, I already committed to this. So you look at that, busy bee. Okay, so but I swear, it's, if, it's an, if I have an album, I'll call it busy bee. Busy bee. Bee. All right. Here we go. Let me see. Here. Just like your overbook. Or you committed to this one already, and then, well, I can't say yes to the other one because I already said yes here, you know. But I feel like you will still, that, but that's gonna um, be just a complex way of your time management. And you have your Queen of Spades, okay. This Queen of Spades, I feel like it's gonna offer you something, okay. Um, it can be, it's like a contract, a job opportunity if you're looking for a job. Um, it's, I feel like it's about, it's just like, can someone can give you an advice also it's like listen this is what's going to, this is what's happening in your life and it's becoming difficult because you just commit here commit there how about this is and that so someone is guiding you queen of spades yeah. um someone is going to give you give you a very informative um approach on how you can make your schedule work because uh, i feel like you're like totally overbooked with a two of spades uh two uh two of diamonds um with regards to the relationship okay if this is a relationship I feel like you said yes, and then you did say yes to the, to the next one. There's no two partners here. I'm just saying, it's a psycho. Okay. Um, that was a glare. Um, I'm just saying that, uh, like, you know how it's like, oh, yeah, yeah, let's go out for dinner. And then you said, it's like, oh, yeah, 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 we can do this also. And it's like, oh, no, I forgot. I got to do this also. So there it has been some overlap. Mm -hmm. Got an ace of hearts. Oh, hello. Okay, so you really love this person, and if it's a romantic connection, 
I feel like the reason why you can't say no to the person or they can't say no to you is like, well, one, you love the person. So no matter what they ask, no matter what, it's just like, hey, can you do this? Hey, this and that. Yes, yes, yes. No matter how busy you are, you're being selfless and not selfish. Mm -hmm. That's good right there. It's the heart that matters for you. And, you know, for you, it's just like my time. While I know it's, uh, it's uh, I'm busy, but it's okay. Because I do love this person. Oh, that's sweet. Okay, that's very sweet. I like that. Okay, keep it going. So let's see what's going on with your tarot. Let's begin. Okay. Let's see. For my concerns. Here we go. Ace of Cons, new lover, you got the best of me, no, um, I feel like it's a date night, it's a meetup, you see, that leads towards, this is like, this is what, this is what you had said, yes, it's just like, it's like, alright, let's start this, it can be a project between you and your partner, it can be, because um, the sun card is, minor arcana is Ace of Pentacles, so, it, uh, sun card is a VK, Ace of Pentacles can be a mini VK, um, it's so hard to just like both of you just wants to spend time with each other. Okay, so that's that one. Ace of Coins is also looking at, I'm looking at it where there's a golden opportunity, okay, for you guys to explore, okay, um, the connection. Because the A's are a gift, right? There is a hand, it's a gift from God. So, you know, God is giving you an opportunity, you know, with this person. Vice versa. For the bros. Oh, hello. Ten of coins right away. And it's an opportunity that leads to pentacles. 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 There you go. Mm. So that's a lot of coins right there. Long term relationship. Legacy. Loyalty. What you have been wishing for. Is right here. Nine is the completion. Nine is the result. Nine is completion. Ten is the outcome. What you work hard for being single, you get you get your rewards. It's ace to the ten, so it's halfway there. Meaning how you guys are dating, um, or seeing this person, you guys are getting you know getting to the next level. Okay. And someone here can be an open book because the chest is open there. Someone is giving you their keys to their heart. It's Venus and Mars, I feel, here. Venus and Scorpio can be. Okay. Let me see. Next to the Ten of Coins. Ah! Queen of Coins! You only need the King now. Okay, Capricorn. Taurus or Virgo. But you have a natural Capricorn. This is your seventh house. So that's gonna be someone, um, whoever you're dating right now, has the intention to really settle down. So, settle down. Okay, the queen um, likes to um, give comfort, of course, because the ten of coins is so good material, material pleasure. So meaning they could, uh, and the ace of coins can be a gift. So very earthy, so it's tangible. This person could probably love to give you gifts. Okay, that's that one. Let me see. Next to the ten of coins, uh, queen of coins. I feel like this person is, if you are the queen of coins, then you're busy, definitely. Nine of coins, and I, what I say, and I say, hey, yeah, 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 hey. What you have been working hard for, being single, it's over. You won't be single anymore. Mm. I called the nine of coins earlier. You did a lot of work for yourself. You know, it's like you invested in yourself. Here comes the outcome. Here comes the result of, you know, it's like of being an adult. Because the nine of coins... You were an adult, a mature adult, and then here comes someone that you can date, okay? That will complete the cycle for you. Nine and ace of coins comes to a complete cycle. Mm. That's good. Keep it going. Mm. Okay, let's see here. Next to the nine of coins. 
Four coins. Very protective. All the coins over here. I feel like both of you, okay, are very greedy with each other. When I say that, it's just like when you want them, you want them. When they want you, they want you. Okay? There's a sense of ownership. Um, it looks like it. Okay? Because that's the... I don't feel like the, uh, this person is holding back. I feel like this person is holding on to the connection. Holding on to you. Next to the four coins. Let's see here. King of Swords, Aquarian Energy, very mature. Um, when I say very mature, it's because this is a person who sees the future with you. They don't play around. But with the four of coins, you could be holding yourself back from this person right now. If they're an air sign, it looks like it. Okay, so it's almost like, well, I don't want to put out right away sounds. So I, like, I like them, you know, I have these feelings for them, but I just want to, it's like, I want to see where it goes first, you know. So you're not, you're not going to show that you're goo goo gaga to this person. You're more of like, okay, well, I did put some work, you know, in me, and now there's someone interested, so let's see where it goes. Okay, because the King of Swords is serious. Okay, so I'm going to continue this reading. Let's see how serious it goes and how this person right now, it's not a test, but I feel like the other person is just holding back, um, excuse me, <coughs> um, to a certain degree before they just jump the gun, okay? So thank you very much, um, concerns for watching. I'll see you guys again. Bye. Hi, concerns. So as always, um, well, if we, uh, we were asking a question during the extended, it was about where is it, when is it moving forward and how is it moving forward. And then, of course, as always, we did get the Wheel of Fortune and then we um, did a transit on how you will get your wish to be granted and it's been answered, but you've been um, in a specific time that you can work with um, as far as like transit energy in the relationship. And then it shows positive news on when it's uh, manifesting. So it's a particular moment um, where the planets are that I've discussed and what your expectations was, um, you know, it's like if this person is going to express their feelings, how it's all going to work out, if it's a person about, um, you know, if it's about reconciliation or working things out, that's there, that's been answered also about the transformation and what news comes towards your way. So there's a bunch of questions that we have answered in the time, um, in the prediction, and it's amazing. I'll see you there. Bye. You healed yourself. You found this is someone who's uh, who found their life purpose, especially the hermit with the coins. This because this is a life purpose that pays the bills. Okay, not the life purpose that. Oh, I'm just uh, how to say this. Um, energetically, um, ship with this, with the ten of coins. Let's see. Oh, hello, wheel of fortune. Judgment about committing. I told you it's gonna move forward. Okay, so consider it. Let's see where this is headed. Okay, we did say that. Okay, when we see the Wheel of Fortune, we're gonna predict the time and transit. I've been um, struggling. Okay, we'll be over. Let me see. And whatever feeling that you have been. Okay. <laughs> that you have been feeling stuck. Okay, that's Eight of Swords. And I said, your wish. Hi everyone, so this is gonna be an unboxing which is always gonna be a surprise as we have created a, a surprise element to our Glamour Crystal Box by Sal. So who knows which one are you gonna get, so let's dive in deep into it. Alrighty, so now who can guess this wonderful box's name? So one thing I will, I'll start singing first for you guys. So one song I will butcher right now is, are you ready guys? It's gonna be a whole new world. A dazzling place I never knew or what is other song? Um Prince Ali Fabulous He Ali Ababwa. Now, okay, I'm gonna drop the bomb now. It is called the Jasmine Box. Now a little bit tricky with this box that we have come up. All boxes comes with a flower name. Okay, not like a power pop girls, but a flower name. Alright, so I'm excited. Let's open it. We know the drill, Sal. Here we go. So so manifesto, we call it now the Glamour Companion, okay? The manifesto comes inside. Everything that you need to know, how to use, where to use, and all those juicy information comes in this uh, wonderful um, um, paper that we come up with. 
And also at the back, you will see the codes, if you have codes that you can use, because we always give out different uh, wonderful freebies at the back. So check that out, you know, in, you know, don't lose this paper, it's very important. However, what is very exciting is like, if you do lose, okay, provided not, not the code, right? If you lose the manifesto, you're out there, you need the information on how to use it, we have it in our blog. So if you log into eTreatLove.me, then you will see there on how to use those stuff, okay? So you're never alone. Our website is always up, hopefully. <laughs> oh, hello. This is our first item over here. Oh, I'm living for this right now. So every time that we create this box, oh, it's like I'm always surprised because it's just like you never know what you're gonna get. And this time we're getting this wonderful, okay, okay. This is a ring, and it's adjustable, okay? So, you can just, ooh, uh, okay. Is it the, I don't know how to get married, so is it the middle finger? <laughs> no, I'm kidding, guys. <laughs> that's, that's when you're not married anymore, you put it there. No, I'm kidding. So, here we go. So, that's the ring finger, if I'm not mistaken. <laughs> so, you have here, oh, that is so nice. If you guys can see it, I'll just hold it here. It says there, live what you love. So, I'll let, hold it a little bit longer, all right? So, you see it? Oh, that's so sweet. I like that. Okay. So that's going to be placed there. Of course, we always have to maintain our energy. As always, we need to cleanse. Okay. So this is our um, our smudge kit. Oh, look at this. A wonderful bow. And then you have your Palo Santo. You have your crystal. And, of course, sage. And one thing that this comes with. Now, everybody's asking about my hair, which is why it's so bouncy, why it's just so glowy. And, you know, it's like, I know, everybody's living for my hair. This is one of the secrets that I use. So I'll be showing you how to use this also, but it's right here. Now, you guys can try it, and you guys can have the same hair as I am. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> no, meaning, like, you will have a very rich and healthy hair. Now, this hair mask, okay? Um, it, we, we will make a separate video on how to use it and watch me and then you know and then you can see how it helps out so if you have a hair problem this is what you can use okay so that's that one. Oh my god i'm so excited this is the last item of course we get this you know it's almost like uh, it's so impossible to open this okay <laughs> all right so here we go there you go so always we come with our gemstones um, the, the gemstones that comes, it will always have the description there so it can help you and it can guide you. So now let me just put this here. Let's put that aside. Okay. Let me put the hair mask over there. Now do be careful, of course, when trying out, you know, products such as this. As I, you know, it's like I, like, you know, if you have anything, allergies, all those ingredients are gonna be posted right there. So just wanna be, you guys, to be careful about, you know, if it if it works for you, then it's good. And of course, it works for me, so it's wonderful. But always be checking those ingredients that you are allergic into, just to give you guys a heads up. Okay. Now, so everybody. This is what you're getting for the wonderful, okay, Jasmine box. I can't wait to try that hair mask because it's like, as you guys know, sometimes I do have a bad hair day. So I'm about to jump onto the shower and try that. I'm excited. I hope you guys are too. So I'll see you guys again.